Get your dancing shoes on. It's time for the Seminoles.com daily report for this Monday morning. I'm Ryan Pincy. The Florida State men's basketball team found out last evening they are headed back to the NCAA tournament for a third straight season. Leonard Hamilton and the guys will head to Chicago, Illinois to take on the Texas A&M Aggies Friday afternoon a little after 4 o'clock. If they win, the Seminoles would uh, move on to the third round, play either Notre Dame or Akron. For head coach Leonard Hamilton, a successful season has just begun. I think that we have a good basketball team. Uh, we've been, we've had our ups and our downs, but I also think that we've learned and grown. Uh, each time that we have faltered, it seems as though we've, we've been rejuvenated and we've learned from our mistakes and we've moved on. And I'm kind of excited about uh, just getting together and practicing and getting prepared to, to go have an opportunity to go play now, you know, for the national championship. Seminoles.com will have complete coverage from Chicago, Illinois, as our own Lane Hurt will be traveling with the men's basketball team, so stay right here at Seminoles.com. We've also got Tournament Central live right now. It's on the bottom footer of Seminoles.com. Check that out for interactive brackets, as well as coverage from Florida State and Texas A&M. Florida State baseball team was down 3-0 yesterday. Got some late help from Rafael Lopez to come away with a sweep of the Boston College Eagles. Mike Martin's pleased with the progress of his team. What was so encouraging for me is the way that we persevered. We stayed tough, we were down three to nothing, Leonard's doing a great job, but we didn't panic, we didn't start chasing pitches out of the zone, we just fought and got it done. Seminoles have a quick turnaround as they head down to the place you know where, Gainesville, Florida, take on the Gators tomorrow evening. We'll have coverage right here at Seminoles.com. Over to the Southwood Golf Course where the Florida State men's golf team had a big showing on Sunday afternoon led by Drew Kittleson. Kittleson shooting a four under par for a tie for first place in the individual rankings. Also helped boost the men's golf team into a tie for third place. Great tournament. Hope you enjoyed it out at Southwood. The guys will be back in action soon. Make sure you check with their schedule on Seminoles.com. And coming up this evening at 6.30, doors open for the NCAA Women's Selection Show. It's in the President's Box of Doe Campbell Stadium. Information can be found on Seminoles.com. You can join the team as they watch the selection show live on ESPN at 7 o'clock. That's it for today's Seminoles.com Daily Report. We'll see you back here tomorrow.